Good morning, welcome back. It's your boy Bowler's Big X, you know. Um, first time posting in a long time. And to be fair, I have been working on some stuff, whether it be school wise, work wise, or YouTube wise. I've been trying to figure some stuff out. I got this software on my computer. I'm trying to figure out how to do all that stuff, all that fun jazz, so I can get more videos out that are better quality, higher quality, and all that fun stuff for y'all. Because I care about you. The, uh, the few I have, I care about to a deep extent. Um, I think we passed 70 the other day, which is amazing. And I haven't made a video in like two weeks. So, but um, yes, you should see a review coming out soon for a bowling ball. No, I won't say what yet. Some people already know, some people don't. Um, I just gotta get that edited together. Even though at the beginning of the time I started the channel, I said I wouldn't do really many edited videos. Well, bowling ball videos are exceptions. Um, then next we're going to have a video between me and Logan Mathis, hopefully coming up soon with some commentary between my dad and I on the video. I'm hoping whenever we get the chance, I'm a busy person. <laughs> and it's very hard to do this because of how busy I am. Because, I mean, I go to school, I go to work, and I bowl. And it's very hard to find free time in there, but... I probably will do these more in the morning now, and that'll give me a chance to talk more, I guess. Give me more of an open vlog. Uh, but, good news, I qualified for the second round of Pepsi. Woohoo. Yeah, I know. The thing is, only one person broke even all year this year in Pepsi. Last year, there was two or three people, I think, that broke even. Um, it was brutal. Uh, Pepsi, if you don't know, is a big statewide tournament. It's a national tournament. They're held each state. Sponsored no other uh, by no other than Pepsi. It's six games of qualifying on last weekend for us, and now it'll be three games, then match play this upcoming Saturday. Uh, I went in, I qualified as ninth, shooting 1051 for six. I bowled bad, 1051 for six, and made cut. <laughs> Just one clap. That's all I get. Um, but no, legitimately, I, I know some really good college bowlers in, who were in this, and they said that this is one of the hardest patterns they ever bowled on. I mean, it felt like a one-to-one -one flat U.S. Open pattern where, you know, you throw it one board right, it's going to the 10-pin, you throw it one board left, it's going to the 7-pin, and if you throw it there... It may not even go to the pocket because you might be throwing the wrong ball. Um, my, be my best look probably was with my Congo. Uh, I I've been coming to learn that that ball is an amazing tournament ball. Um, Play Masters, uh, Bitcoin and Congo is a great tournament ball. It's really fun to throw, really controllable, really predictable. I'm going to get you in the center of the camera because that bothers me. But yeah, uh, I'm maybe do a vlog when I get down there. I'll be going with my both my mom and my dad. And I don't know how my mom will take to being on YouTube. I don't know. She's never been on my channel before. Maybe we'll find out. Um, she's more of a quiet person compared to my dad and I. But who knows? Maybe she'll offer some nice insight and all that. Um, and am I excited for the next round of Pepsi? Yes, but no at the same time because, you know... I'm excited to go and compete, but I'm not excited to have to bowl in that oil pattern again. Well, I mean, it's bowling, so I'm kind of excited anyway, but, like, that was brutal. I mean, last year I qualified second, I shot, like, 1180 in Pepsi. I'm not going to talk about what I did after that, but, like, I thought that was pretty cool. I was like, ah, oh, I shot really good. I got a lot of the momentum. I don't have a lot of momentum going into this upcoming Saturday. Um... I'm leaving Friday night, by the way, so I'll probably do a video then, if I do a video, which I'm trying to, because I need to get back to uploading. Not the point. Um, yeah, but it, it's it's difficult. I mean, when you don't when you're ninth place out of twelve or out of twelve that make cut. At least all the scores we set, but there's a lot of people up there. They're pretty talented. I mean, probably one of the best college bowlers in the state who's still youth, which is. Peyton Smith, he's second. Buddy of mine, Chloe Mathis. You'll see a video. He, if you don't know him, he's on Prodigy. He was uh, in one of my vlogs recently. He can throw the ball really good. 
and with a lot of power and he can just kill it on patterns like this um we got josh donaghy who if you don't know josh from prodigy as well he's a beast two-hander i've known him since i kind of started he kind of helped me when i was at the beginning of two-handed when because I, I started off as a two-hander for those of you who don't know and like i got i went to one-handed eventually but like he kind of taught me him and another one of my friends they taught me how to bolt two-handed to the best of my ability which wasn't that good at the time now i'm a lot better two-handed bowler than i was then um who else is there uh Charlie Bostic. All of y'all should know who Charlie Bostic is. I mean, he's on Prodigy every week, winning almost every week. And that man's ridiculous. He's a good friend of mine, too. Part of Mixed Mob Nation, you know. Hashtag Mixed Mob. Um, I'm trying to think. A uh, friend of mine from the All Stars. There's a few. There's basically a bunch of All Stars. Current or former All Stars or soon to be All Stars. That's all who made it for the U20 boys. But it should be fun bowling on Blue 3 that doesn't play like Blue 3. It plays like USB Open. US, uh, that US Open 2012. Oh, well. It'll be fun. Uh, just want to keep an updated vlog, you know, because I haven't done one of these in forever. But, and I think that'll be it, actually. No buts, no whats. I think it was a nice six and a half minute long vlog. It's a pretty good quality vlog. So, I'll end this good morning off with a happy and hearty salute.